Hello, good morning viewers. Still on to how to solve second order linear homogeneous differential equation. I have another problem for us to solve. Suppose we are given the second derivative of y with respect to x minus 4 times the first derivative of y with respect to x plus 4y equals 0. We want to solve this second order linear homogeneous differential equation. Remember, the first thing you need to do is to transform the equation into an auxiliary form O, the characteristic equation, by setting y double prime to be equal to r squared, y prime to be equal to r, and y to be equal to 1, where y double prime is the same thing as the second derivative of y with respect to x, y prime is the same thing as the first derivative of y with respect to x, and y is the same thing as y. So now let us substitute. Here we have r squared minus 4 times first derivative, which we have here as r, then plus 4 times y, and y is 1. The whole of this equal to 0. So this is our characteristic equation, or the auxiliary equation, which is in the form of a quadratic equation. We are going to solve for r. The nature of r, which is the root of the equation, will determine the form of general equation we are going to obtain. So let's so solve for r. By factorization, We are going to think of two numbers which when we multiply them together we get the constant term which is 4 and when added off together we get the coefficient of the middle term which is negative 4. The numbers are negative 2, negative 2 because negative 2 times negative 2 is positive 4 but negative 2 plus negative 2 is negative 4. If we set each of these factors to be equal to 0 we are going to obtain r equal to 2 for both uh, factors. So we say twice. So we say we have real and equal roots. If we obtain real and equal roots, the general form of our solution is going to be in the form of y equals uh, c, a constant, multiplied by e to the root, the root we have times x plus another constant times x e to that root multiplied by x. So now let us substitute. So therefore our general solution is a constant e to the r and our r is 2 to x plus another constant times x e to 2x. To so this is our general solution for this differential equation. Suppose we are given some initial conditions. We can use those initial conditions, substitute into this equation, and obtain our corresponding constant and substitute them back to obtain a particular solution. So this is all I have for you today. Thank you for watching. Do have a nice day.